Cancer is one of the most difficult diseases to manage. However, there are many hospitals in the world that can provide patients with the latest, cutting-edge treatments in order to give the best chance to fight against it. Doctors and scientists are always searching for and discovering new ways to treat cancer. According to Insider Monkey, these are the 10 best cancer treatment hospitals in the world. 10. Peter McCallum Health Centre, Australia Situated in Victoria, Australia, the Peter McCallum Health Centre is the first public hospital in Australia that is solely dedicated to cancer patients. With more than 2,500 healthcare staff, including over 580 clinical and laboratory researchers, Peter Mac is focused on providing better care, better treatments and potential cures for cancer. The institution moved to a brand new building last June 2016 with state-of-the-art facilities and an imposing 80,000 square feet of research space. Peter Mack is known for providing 24-hour on-site pathology services, apheresis haematology treatments, genetic testing, digital mammography, and having a breast tomosynthesis unit with biopsy capabilities. The hospital has five centres in Victoria, namely in Melbourne, Box Hill, Bendigo, Moorabbin, and Sunshine. Oslo Comprehensive Cancer Centre, Norway at the heart of Oslo, Norway, lies a high-tech cancer research facility. Located at the Oslo University Hospital, the Oslo Comprehensive Cancer Centre has more than 320 employees and seven research departments in its Institute for Cancer Research. Founded in 1954, the centre boasts of its strong researches in the fields of biochemistry, cell and tumour biology, genetics, radiation biology, immunology and cancer prevention. During the first half of 2016, six researchers from the centre were granted awards for their outstanding work and were given funding to continue their research. Some of their cutting-edge cancer technology include flow cytometry and preclinical imaging, advanced imaging with confocal microscopy, super resolution capabilities, electron microscopy, stem cell-based tumor therapy, genomic sequencing facility, and bioinformatics research. 8. Institut Gustave Roussy, France Located in Villejuif, France, the Institut Gustave Roussy is known as the premier European cancer centre. Innovation is at the core of this institution, leveraging scientific and technological advancements in the treatment of cancer. It was founded by Professor Gustave Roussy, the founding father of the cross-boundary working concepts and multidisciplinary patient management. The hospital's approach to oncology is founded on Roussy's values, innovation, dynamism, cooperation and benevolence. It is also anchored on its three guiding principles, namely patient care, research, and teaching. The Institute specializes in rare cancers and complex tumors. Some of their groundbreaking researches and treatments include DNA repair, surgical radiology, molecular medicine, and anti-tumor immunology. It is also the home of translational research, which helps doctors draw on research when developing treatment protocols. Seven, Netherlands Cancer Institute, the Netherlands. Established in 1913, the Netherlands Cancer Institute, NKI, has been treating cancer patients for 103 years. With 650 scientists on board, along with 185 specialists, this institute is no doubt one of the 10 best cancer hospitals in the world. It is the only hospital in the Netherlands solely dedicated to cancer. Some of its leading technologies in cancer treatment include a carcinogen lab, biostatistics center, flow cytometry center, genomics core facility, and molecular pathology. Just this month, the Institute has discovered a new drug that is effective for ovarian cancer that doesn't respond to chemotherapy. The AZD1775 was revealed by Dr. Jan Schellens of NKI, who conducted the clinical trials. 6. Spanish National Cancer Research Center, Spain Located in Madrid, Spain, the Spanish National Cancer Research Center, CNIO, is known for applying technologically advanced treatments for cancer patients. The Institute's goal was to foster translation of scientific breakthroughs into novel and more effective ways to prevent, diagnose, and treat cancer. The hospital is living up to its mission with its cutting-edge technology and clinical trials, with programs specializing in molecular oncology, experimental therapeutics, and human cancer genetics. The Spanish National Cancer Research Center is known for its advanced technologies, including structural biology and biocomputing, cytogenetics, DNA sequencing, advanced histopathology processing, pediatric tumor treatment, and human cancer genetics. 5. Roswell Park Cancer Institute, the US The Roswell Park Cancer Institute is the country's first cancer center. Founded in 1898, the center takes pride in its multidisciplinary approach to treating cancer. The institute was built on the vision of eminent surgeon Dr. Roswell Park, who rightfully predicted that cancer would become the leading cause of death in the US and around the world. 
The centre is known for its quality improvement programme that aims to provide high quality, cost-effective patient care, while preserving and enhancing the dignity, humanity and knowledge of the patients served. The Institute is launching the first clinical trial in the US for a lung cancer treatment called CIMA-VAX EGF vaccine. Some of its advanced cancer technologies include balloon kyphoplasty, electro nerve stimulation, interventional radiology, photodynamic therapy advanced endoscopy, interventional pulmonology, and nuclear medicine. 4. Abramson Cancer Center, the US Located at the hospital of the University of Pennsylvania, the Abramson Cancer Center is known for its innovation, cutting-edge technology, and translational medicine. It has one of the biggest clinical trial programs in the US. The center has been named as Translational Centers of Excellence for lung, breast, blood, and pancreatic cancers. Translational medicine is the process of translating research-based medical discoveries into a cure. It was named a comprehensive cancer center in by the National Cancer Institute in 1973 and has maintained that premier status ever since. The Abramson Cancer Center is home to over 400 basic, translational and clinical scientists who work tirelessly to find out the pathogenesis of cancer. Some of its advanced technologies include HIV oncology program, bone marrow and stem cell transplant program, melanoma and pigmented lesion program, GI cancer program, cancer risk evaluation program, largest proton therapy center, genitourinary cancer program, immunotherapy, and telegenic program. 3. John Hopkins Sydney Kimmel Comprehensive Cancer Center, the US. Headquartered in Baltimore, Maryland, the John Hopkins Hospital Sydney Kimmel Comprehensive Cancer Center is one of the premier cancer facilities in the US. It can accommodate more than 980 patients and has more than 46,600 admissions yearly. John Hopkins is synonymous with excellent patient care and research, and the Sydney Kimmel Comprehensive Cancer Centre is a testament to that. Established in 1983, the centre is a world leader in deciphering the mechanisms of cancer and discovering new ways to treat it. It was one of the first institutions to earn the status Comprehensive Cancer Centre and recognised as a centre of excellence. The centre has a wide spectrum of specialty programmes for adults and children with cancer. It has a cancer counselling centre, palliative care programs, and a patient family suite for those traveling from different states or countries. The center is also known for its art of healing program, merging technologies to heal the body and a nurturing environment to heal the human spirit. Among the hospital's advanced treatments are cell cycle regulation, robot-assisted cancer surgeries, DNA repair, signal transduction, plasmapheresis, immunology, stem cell transplants, and melanoma vaccine research. The facility is also known for being the leader in genetic cancer research. 2. Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, the US Located in New York City, the Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center is one of the leading cancer hospitals in the country. It can accommodate more than 470 patients with over 24,000 admissions yearly. It was established in 1884 and was then known as New York Cancer Hospital. Memorial Sloan is known as the world's oldest and largest private cancer center treating patients for over 130 years. The strength of this hospital is their exceptional patient care, innovative research, and outstanding educational programs. They provide genetic counseling and psychological support to their cancer patients. Some of their leading cancer treatments include robot-assisted surgery, minimal access surgery, intraoperative radiation therapy, Artemis intraoperative imaging technology, and immune checkpoint blockade therapy. One. University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center, the US. Recognized as the number one cancer hospital in the world, the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center has a laser-focused mission to eliminate cancer in Texas, the country, and the world. It was established in 1941 by Monroe Dunaway Anderson, a banker and cotton trader who left a substantial amount of money for healthcare. This was then awarded to the University of Texas to build a hospital for cancer research and treatment. MD Anderson Cancer Center can accommodate more than 600 cancer patients, with over 26,000 admissions yearly. Some of their groundbreaking cancer treatments include laser proton therapy, interstitial thermal therapy, stem cell transplant, accelerated partial breast irradiation APBI, and stereotactic body radiation therapy SBRT. The hospital also has leading chemotherapy treatments such as angiogenesis inhibitors, gene therapy, hypothermic intraperitoneal chemotherapy HIPEC, and immunotherapy. These hospitals are committed to finding a cure for cancer while giving the best patient care. Their doctors and medical staff are devoting their lives to making sure that cancer will soon be a curable disease. 
With all of the successful clinical trials and ever-progressing medical technology, we are positive that we will eventually get to a point when cancer will no longer be a threat to our lives. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel for more Top Truths content. In the meantime, feel free to take a look at our videos here.